afternoon. So today was a pretty chill day in Sim. We learned how to make whitening trays in the morning. And then after that, we just had some time to practice for our operative progress exam tomorrow. Tomorrow's progress exam is going to be the first one for this section of operative. So basically we're going to be given a scenario, some radiographs, and then we have to write a soap note prep and restore the chief concern and then chart all of the other carries and necessary restorations. Since we had today and yesterday to practice, I came home a little early. I ended up getting my flu shot and now I'm just going to have lunch, watch TV for a little bit, and then the rest of the afternoon I have a couple of things that I need to do. For lunch, I'm having mapo tofu. Now that I finished my workout, I wanted to sort through some teeth really quick before I shower. So I just changed into some old scrubs and I don't even want to touch this because it grosses me out still. But yep, I have a jar of teeth that I've been collecting for maybe three years, two or three years. For our endo module, we need specific teeth. We need four anteriors, four bicuspids and four molars and two maxillary, two mandibular for each molar and bicuspid. So I have to go through this entire jar of teeth and sort through which ones I can use. And I'm gonna do that outside on the patio. So I brought all of this PPE home from school. I have two baggies with like a formalin solution. I think that's what it's called. I have some empty containers and these will be filled with saline for the ones that I will be using next week. These ones are for long-term storage. I got some gloves, my mask, goggles, my face shield, and a gown. So let's get to it. I will admit this was not the best idea considering it is 101 degrees outside, but I'm a little impatient and I have a lot to do today, so. Let's just get this out of the way. I just emptied out this jar and now I'm going to place it on the paper and start sorting. Sweating. All right, so I finished sorting out my teeth. I still have to bring them into clinic and x-ray them so I know whether or not I can use them. But I have a jar of anteriors and bicuspids in here. A jar of molars. I have two other jars of either really heavily restored teeth or have like extremely, extremely prominent decay so I don't know whether or not I'll be able to use them. As I was sorting through the teeth I saw like existing restorations and some crown preps 
and crack teeth and it's actually pretty cool now that I think about it when I was working as a dental assistant you know I didn't really understand or think about these things but now that we've been practicing restorations and learning all these courses about operative dentistry it just kind of ties everything together and yeah it's just kind of crazy how I've kind of come full circle as a dental assistant I was just collecting teeth and a couple years later here I am getting ready to practice restoring on these teeth so it has been a wild ride I'm gonna place these back into the bag so that these liquids don't spill everywhere and now I'm gonna take a very very thorough shower <laughs>